Hi everyone, I'm Engineer Shane and today we're going to discuss about doors and windows. Our outline for today will be the definition parts, plans designation, manpower, and estimate. To define what is a door, it is an opening, open able barrier or as a framework made of wood, steel, aluminum, glass, or a combination of these materials secured in a wall opening. It is made of wood or steel or glass, depende ko ano ang afford and ang depende sa functionality na isa-serve ng doors. And naka-secure siya sa isang wall opening. Siyempre nga naman, ang nagbabind sa kanya is yung wall na merong opening. It is provided to give access to the inside of a room of a building. Yes, it is an access para makapasok no, or makalabas. Use two screen areas of a building for aesthetic para ma-distinguish natin kung alin yung bagong room at yung hindi. Kung yung open area. Then use two screen areas of a building for aesthetic purposes. Keep formal and utility areas separate. Yes. Ano ba yung mga parts and sizes ng mga doors? We have here the common width of 0.4 to 0.6 and then a height of 1.2 meters plus yung width niya. So, depende. Pansin niyo ninyo, measure your doors sa bahay ninyo. It's normally uh, uh, yung uh, 2.1 meters. Yun yung normal. And also sa mga condominiums, yun yung makikita natin. The general sizes used for the external walls, we have here the 0.1 by, point, by 2 to 1.1 to point, uh, 2 meters. Ayan. So, nilagay na dito more of 2 meters yung height normally. Yeah. And then for the public, we have here the 1.2 by 2 meters or 1.2 by 2.1. So 2.1 yung height and then width is 1.2 or 2.25. And then the, the measurement after that nung height, ano na siya mga high ceiling doors na hindi na siya normal or regular doors. For the parts here, here are the head or the head jump, the stop kung meron pang stop, then the strike jump here. And then the hinge, yung visagra, ika nga. Then the door hardware or the lock set, yung knob. Okay, kasama yun. And then the door protection, kung merong kick plate or mop plate. And then the threshold to hold yung door. Normally, ang common natin makikita ang mga uh, parts of doors is the head jump, the hinge, the lock set. The others are accessories. The designation in the drawing May kita natin, ano siya, a shark tail. Ganun yung itsura niya sa drawing. For us to be familiarized, ito yung itsura niya. Ayan. And then, meron lang siya mga different designations. Depende sa gusto ng designer. Ayan. So, meron dito tayo dito sliding doors, in and out. So, kapag dual purpose siya. Kapag double door, tapos interior, ganun siya. Diba? So, single door interior or double acting single door. Pwede siyang buka, push, or pull yung pinto. So, may mga designation siya. For the exercise, here we have the door mark, yung naka-red. Ayan, mga door marks yan. Para siyang mga tail, shark, shark tail-like na mga figures. Okay? For the windows, windows naman is an opening in the wall of a building. Same sila ng door na opening, pero ito at a certain height. For the admission of the light and air. Ang purpose naman ito is for the air and light to come in. And yung mga bad air naman to come out of the room. Yung door is for person, purpose, di ba? Ito naman, iba naman. But still an opening. Arranged for the purpose of architectural decoration. It's also, it's normally made on glass. Yung bigger face niya. Pero yung mga frames niya, pwede din gawa sa steel or sa wood. The sizes are commonly ng windows are 600 by 1.2, 1 by 1.2 meters, 1.2 by 1.2. So, depende. Meron tayong may kita mga rectangular, meron din mga square na mga bintana. So, windows are customized. So, kahit anong depende sa gusto ng client, pwede natin siyang gawin. For the windows designation, here we can see the green mark, window mark. Ayan, so we have different uh, we have different illustration also for the windows. 
Ayan yung mga itsura niya. Depende rin sa bukas. Diba? Katulad din sa doors kanina. Depende sa bukas niya. And it also depends on the designer kung anong gusto niyang mga designation na ilagay. But at least we're, we are going to be familiar with this type of legends and symbols para naman alam natin kung anong itsura niya sa plan. Next is how to estimate doors and windows. It is as simply as by direct counting method. Based on the specification per door and window, let's estimate the door for D1, D2, and D4. For the windows, W1, W2, and W3. So, kung hahanapin natin yan, nasan ba yung ating uh, window? Uh, doors pala muna, here. Ito yung doors natin. We have here D2. Ayan. Abaguhin natin yung ano. Wait lang, para ma... Baguhin natin yung ating legend. So, we have here, D1 pala muna tayo, D1. Hanapin natin yung D1. So, here we have D1. And then, 2. And then, that's it. So, two pieces tayo ng D1. For D2, let's use another color. D2 tayo. So, we have here, yan, 1, 2, kasi pa, 3. So, toilet and bath. So, we have here. So, that's 4. Okay? For the D4 naman, let's use another one. We have here D4. So, ito. Pipe chase yung tawag dito. So, yan makukuha natin. So, we have here two pieces. For the windows, ang um, gawa naman tayo another designation. May kita natin, di ba, yung windows W, yung indication. So, we have here W1. Ayan. We have here, uh, no, that one. Ayan. So, Two pieces, so we have here the W1. For the W2, use tayo another color. We have here two pieces ito, W2. Ayan, two pieces, di ba? They're counting tayo. And for, and for the W3, we have here, let's use another color ng pen. Let's try black. Nasaan yung W3? So, para maghahanap lang tayo dito. Ito. So, yan. We have here W3. Meron pa daw. Nasaan yung W3 pa natin? Wait, wait. Ito. W3. Yan. Windows din yan. So, we have here four pieces. So, that's it. Direct counting lang tayo ng ating doors and window quantity para ma-estimate natin siya. To summarize, we learn in doors and windows the definition, the parts, the recommended sizes, the plans, designation, and estimates. If you have any question, just drop your comment on the section below and I'll be happy to answer your question. That's it for today's discussion. For more content and learnings, follow me on the following social media platforms and don't forget to subscribe on this channel. For more engineering lectures and more topics about self-love, time management, and life discovery. This is in partnership with Cloud Construction Consultancy. See you on the next video. Bye!